He was the kind of dad who always sacrificed. He was thinking a lot about us and cares. And 55-year-old Kuder Hamdan showed his caring ways until the very end. How he got killed, that's still in my mind. Ali Kasim says he and his brother tried to sell a car on social media Tuesday. Kasim was stuck at work, so that evening he asked his dad to meet with a potential car buyer for him. A quick test drive around South Arlington. Arlington police say two people showed up. The dad, Hamdan, went on the test drive with them. Then police say one of the suspects shot him. That's all I can think about. I sent him to this guy and he got killed. That's the thought that leaves this son haunted. Investigators believe Hamdan tried to get away, but collapsed in a neighborhood along Port Richmond Way. I can't imagine how he, how he lied down and how he got killed. Police say neighbors tried to help, but he later died. The suspects in these surveillance photos took off and abandoned the car nearby. Why they did this? For what? For a car? Now a big family is left without their rock. I mean, he's everything for us. Hamdan left his home country of Iraq in pursuit of a better life for his six kids in the U.S. Now his death leaves them feeling lost. We can't live here without him because we come here together. Their togetherness is what he'll try to hold on to. We're going to miss him a lot. The family wants these two suspects arrested so that someone else won't have to go through this. Arlington police tell me they've received multiple tips on this case, but as of tonight, there are still no arrests. Meanwhile, Hamdan's family is planning his funeral in his home country of Iraq. In Arlington, I'm Adriana de Alba.